Hello everyone. So in this video, I'll explain you how we can import the data into Tally from bank statement. So I'll just open my uh, demo company, and I have loaded one TDL file for integrate the data. Uh, after that, after loading TDL file, you can see this option like integration tool. In that file, uh, in this uh, menu, you have we have provided two options like bank statement upload and Excel mapper. So in Excel mapper, you have uh, you can create multiple templates like as per your bank statements like HDFC Bank, SBI. Okay. So I'll open one HBI. Okay. So you can see the uh, there are some uh, fields you can configure like template for HBI. Okay. Then select payment voucher type. Then receipt voucher type. Contra voucher type. After that you can see there are options as voucher date, ledger name, amount condition, debit amount, credit amount, narration and check number. Okay. So I just open my Excel file of SBI bank so this is my excel file which we uh, which i have downloaded from uh, SBI portal okay so there are serial number transaction date value date description check number credit debit amount balance uh, like closing balance and ledger name so in bank statement ledger name are not uh, uh, so bank statement uh, uh, ledger so bank statement is not provided ledger name so i have added one more additional column manually into this excel because of uh, every transaction are two effects like debit and credit so uh, now as per excel template i have configured column numbers into tally prime so you can see the voucher date is on number three okay then ledger name my ledger name column is 11 so i count 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 okay then amount condition is on 6 3 4 5 6 like amount condition means like your debit and credit so and debit amount is on 8 so which uh, which is your debit amount 3 4 5 6 7 8 so 63 is your debit amount okay then narration so narration is on fourth number one two three four then check number if you have check number input so check number is on five fifth column i just save the file and go to integration tool now in that in this company i have no vouchers so there are no entries in this company so i just go to integration tool bank statement upload so i just select import file path so my file path is in this folder app saw ca jatinsa so i just select this path and paste it over here after that i just select my excel file which we have to import then i have to select template which we have configured with my bank statement then your bank account ledger name after that import bank statement voucher from excel file so i just select yes so vouchers will automatically import into tally after that you can see the one log file will be open so voucher number and uh, payment imported successfully and one receipt entry is imported successfully because in excel file there are first entries a credit to bank and second is a debit so i'll one in one will go to payment and one will go to receipt so i just see payment entry so bank interest will be debit into 63 and your bank ledger will be credit okay now i go to receipt and open just receipt entry so bank charges will be credit 1.18 and bank account will be debit and you can see narration also will pick from your excel file as per your excel 
which you have uh, put in your excel file 